What's up guys, we're gonna work the uh, darts that I kind of mentioned in another video. And because I got the gear, I'm gonna show you a little darts Ezekiel, right? So we're in side control, super simple setup to uh, the cradle. In this particular instance, I have my opponent's arm shelved up on my hip. Like having him like this, we're not doing that in this situation. So however I may have got my opponent's uh, arm shelved, I like to have my knee underneath his head. So I'm here like this, right? He naturally wants to defend the mount so we're here, and I'll just reach back nice and low, and I'm gonna get behind him real low, and I'm driving with my toes and everything forward, because I always want him on his side. See, if I cradle in here, he has a hard time pushing on my face or fighting back. When I cradle in like this, he can start to do many different defenses. So that's why in my previous videos, and now, I'm gonna say it's important that our opponent is always on their side when we cradle them. Not belly down, and not belly up. So again, I'm like this. Maybe I trapped his arm or whatnot over here. And I'm like, oh, here's the time. I feel his knee on my ribs. Swim back, touch my butt, get all the way down underneath his leg and drive. I drive all the way forward on my toes. Now I can capture that cradle. Because his arm is trapped like this, I'm gonna trap it a little bit more so he can't pull his arm out. I used to go for the darts like this and Len can retract his arm in his back. So when I have him sideways and I shelf a little higher, Len try and pull your body out. And I'm chilling. For here, I put my arm around his neck and I drop my knee, in the best world, I want it to go over his arm, look. And I trap, that's the best thing in the world. Sometimes that always doesn't happen, but that's my goal, knee right here. Okay, so my arm comes through, and I hear, can I hit the doors? Or, turn with me then, I have my sleeve, and I come around his head, and I have an Ezekiel choke, and I just extend. One more time, from here, and I got his arm trapped. I'm underneath his arm, underneath his leg, and I push, Ooh, oh, like that. And then I trap, bring my knee up nice and tight. My arm slides around his head. I can push his body if I want, all right? I come inside, get the dart. So maybe I'm like, oh, I'm short armed or I just like doing Ezekiel's. I bring my arm to the inside and then I extend and lift. And he taps, we can roll, we can do whatever, he'll tap. Just a little variation I like to do because my arm gets stuck. Like you see, I'm a long arm guy, but still in the gi, there's friction. But at least I can get this. If I can't get that, I can get that. Thank you. 